Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Dyson Sphere program and today we're going to hopefully finish off our planetary logistics. The next stage is, if we have a look, when I get onto it, is this particle container. Uh, we've got everything else as you can see. The particle container is a little bit of a tricky one um, because it requires the graphene and the other two parts we've got perfectly fine. That's not an issue, but we need graphene. So that's the main thing for today and as you can see graphene is graphite and sulfuric acid sulfuric acid is the problem we've got so for sulfuric acid we're going to need ourselves an oil drill oil extractor we're then going to need a chemical plant and we're also going to need an oil refinery so let's go ahead and get our oil refinery set up and i'm not too worried at the moment about how much this is going to take but let's go ahead and um just use standard belts for now Choose everything as standard. Go ahead and get some power in there. Obviously, we're going to want oil. Gives us. Ooh, I have a good idea. So we need. I'm wondering. Okay, you don't have enough power, do you? No. Go ahead and connect our power supply. There you go. Now you've got power. So I'm actually going to refine our oil refinery. Um, I'm going to want some more power. Let's go ahead and run this up here. Oh, I haven't got any of them. Let's just grab one of them. Go. That should produce when it clears it through. There we go. And if we, I'm actually going to need two of these, aren't I? Yep, I'm going to need two of these because I don't want to do much into a problem. Here we go. Let's just go ahead and make some more of them. Okay, so the first one I'm going to plonk on. Uh, in fact, let's just go. Let's do this a better way. So we're gonna want. So all this is gonna produce is hydrogen and oil. So do this, and then we do this, and then we do this. We then set you to filter hydrogen only. Uh, I think if I do that. There you are. There we go. And then if I do this here. Oh, you want to go there. Just double check make sure this is going to work. Yep, you should work. Let's go ahead and Blank you there. There we go. Hydrogen only. And then this one can go as. Uh, we need to get one ready. Yep. Uh, oil. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to get some uh, power generation. Uh, we can't because we need some coils. Let's go ahead and get some coils. I think I got some coils around here somewhere. I do. Coils. There we go. Oh, 
We're actually low on iron as well. While we're here, you've got no iron left. Have you got some iron left? Iron. Yes, there we go. We're going to need some more power for this. There we go. Okay, back to what we were working on. There we go. Right, so now we've got our storage containers. That's going to annoy me. But it's fine. It'll do for now. Okay. Power supply. I think I can directly connect that off that. No, I can't. Bring can you a little bit further back. Bring you to here. Uh, power. Go. Excellent. What I may actually do is bring the double the. There we go. Then bring you to here. And then we've got There we go. Double the oil production. That should keep us topped up nicely. Right now I want to produce further. I'm now going to bring this to about here, I think. Yep, so we're going to have you there, and then you into here, like so. Going to need some more power. Let's just uh, place another wind turbine there. I used the wind turbines because they're connectors as well, but they generate enough power to keep us going. Right, so we need oil in and hydrogen in. There we go. And you're going to create more hydrogen and graphene. We're actually going to probably want to go with some hydro power, hydrogen power plant as well. Um, so let's go ahead and get some more belts because we're going to run out. But I'm going to bring you around to here, like so. And let's put a splitter in here. Um, bring you around to here. I was almost, I was almost right. Filter, hydrogen. There we go. Then um, should be producing graphene for me. Go ahead and place another power supply here, just to burn off some of this spare hydrogen. There we go. It will probably burn. Oh, there we go. Graphene. Right, so we got our graphene. But what we need. Oh, high strength crystals. Crystals. Um, what I'm actually going to do is I want hydrogen to come off two points. So if I bring this point to. When am I going to want my hydrogen to come? I want to want my graphene to come this way. So we'll, we'll send this this way for now. Then I'm going to change this setting to be graphene, not hydrogen. You're fine. Let's just extend the belt. Go. 
go. That means hydrogen will come off both sides. So, now that we've got that sorted, let's go ahead and um, look at our chemical plant. What do we need for the sulfuric acid? So we're going to need water, which we've got right next to us. Stone, which I've got right next to us. I think it's stone. Yeah, stone and refined oil. It's not hydrogen, it's oil, because I'm an idiot. He's graphing for something else. So let's just uh, let's keep things ticking for now. Let's just place you there. I'm gonna adjust you in a minute. Go. Uh, you're gonna need some power supply. Okay, right. Let's get uh, get a water pump. Go. So we need water. We're going to need stone. I'm not really fussed about how much. Well, you know what? I am a little bit fussed about how much. Okay, yeah. Uh, we'll do that for now. Stone. The last one we need is oil. All right. The oil into here. Okay, there we go. We need some power supply. There we go. And that's going to give us our sulfuric acid. Go ahead and Bring that over to here. We need more belts. Wow, we are going through belts today. Oh, I'm just going to place that into my connection here. Right, so now that we've got sulfuric acid, we need to now have a look at what we require for our particle containers. Now, is that unipolar magnet? Yeah, well, we don't have that at the moment. So, we need graphene, which takes the graphite that we've got and that sulfuric acid. We then need copper ingots and electromagnetic, like, electromagnetic turbines. Um, but all we actually need is everything else we can do inside our replicator for now is the graphene. Go ahead. That's the sulfuric acid. That's the graphene. Go ahead and. Is it smelter? Nope. Already broken my stuff. I think it might be another chemical plant, actually. Let's just get another chemical plant. What are we missing? Right, we need iron. Iron. Let's go and get some iron. Oh, the stuff is looking to start being a bit empty. go we're finally getting to the stages where I can start looking to organize things a little bit better which is what I'm looking forward to that's our sulfuric acid Is it this that I need? It is. There it is. Right. Okay. So it is this. Right. So we're going to need our sulfuric acid and our graphene. So if we go about 
that's if we do this here now change this so it goes to here and then make this go to here and you can go so We want to be graphene. Go. Oh, that's the wrong button to press. And that's what we needed. Perfect. That's just going to slowly build away at that. What's, what's the delay? Why are we getting... few bits going? Why is, why is it all going to the one? Slightly annoying. Right, let's expand our... ore production... Uh, call it uh, oil production in the oil refinery go now let's see how that goes we get some at least to go over to that way that's moderately annoying I'm hoping this will backlog soon Okay, you know what? I'm going to take the power off for now. You're, yeah, you need the oil. Let's try and cause the backlog. There, it's slowly starting the backlog a little bit now. Right, let's have a look how the oil's doing. Oil's still backlogged, so we can actually go ahead and... What do I need? What do I need? What do I need? Everything needs glass now. Oh, there we go. We're starting to get a backlog. Finally. Not that much hydrogen. But we've got what we wanted. We've got what we wanted, so we can now, hopefully, <laughs> need a lot more of these. Need a lot more of these. Yeah, that's fine. We have a stack of them. And then we have our planetary logistics, which is exactly what we needed to then get started with actually what we're planning on doing with this series, which is having everything nicely, um, kind of like organized and whatnot. Finally. Took us a while, but we got there. Right. I have another power refinery. Go. This is going to be skew if, isn't it? I don't think that can... I don't think it can connect there. I think it's going to be too close on that side as well, but we'll see. Oh no, it'll go. Power. I think it's going to be the last one I put on here. There we go. 
Okay, production is good. We're backed up. Everything's running. And we've got power supply as well to help with the strain. Excellent. We got a little bit of graphene, which goes into here. And we got any coal about? I thought we'd have some coal about. No, no coal. Not a problem. So I think we're sorted. So this was the one thing that we needed. That took us a little bit while to get to because um, it's pretty much what's holding us up now with these little particle generator things um so but we're, we're, we're a little bit closer now which is great it's, it's what we wanted as a matter of fact once they're completed we can probably build our first planetary logistics station which means we can then start to bring things together a little bit easier so we don't need all of this kind of stuff all we need is basically these pumping into storage and then the storage to then deliver to where we need it to go. Um, yeah, we got another oil. That's what I wanted to check. We got another oil there. This oil's actually quite a good one. It's a 3.1 per second. So that's going to have no issue supplying that. I don't think we're even getting. Yeah, look, the belt's full constantly. They're not working constantly, which is what I wanted to check. So, yeah, everything is going extremely well. I'm happy with how things are looking. Let me know in the comment section if you've got your own suggestions or ideas. Again, remember this is this is what we've been building up for. We're finally getting towards it. But it's not optimized and it's not well placed. It's not really anything at the moment. It is literally just a yeah, haphazard way of getting to my point. Which is my planetary logistics station. Which we are not far from at all. Four more of our particle containers and we have our first planetary logistics station so let me know as i say in the comments section if you've got any suggestions ideas or anything but until next time everybody take care for now and i shall see you all on the next one bye bye for now